Here along the Grand Strand, support for those affected by Helene continues to grow with churches, businesses, and local groups organizing events to assist those in need. News 13's Hannah Huss Stickler was at a Stuff a Truck event in Carolina Forest and shows us how much was collected in just a short amount of time. A local business teamed up with Carolina Forest Community Church with one goal in mind, to fill their U-Haul as much as possible. Extra Room Self Storage started collecting items around 8 a.m. at Carolina Forest Community Church and stayed until the truck was completely full around 2 p.m. Jessica Griffith is the facility manager at Extra Room Self Storage and says they wanted to do anything they could to help those affected by Hurricane Helene. We're definitely going to do our part. We, I mean, we're no strangers to hurricanes, you know, and what happened out there was biblical. Community members brought hundreds of pounds of dog food, water, feminine hygiene products, first aid items, non-perishable food, and someone even brought a portable baby crib. Griffith says the devastation in North Carolina impacts those in our area as well. We all are transplants here. We all have friends, family, loved ones who are out there in the affected areas. So it really hits home, not just for us, but a lot of people in the community. They will be taking the truck to the Black's Tire distribution in Whiteville, North Carolina. They have a portion of their distribution center allotted just for the collections and stuff. And then their trucks take them out there to the churches in the local communities. So it gets evenly distributed, you know, throughout the entire uh, region. Griffith says they also have a facility in Monk's Corner in the Low Country and will be collecting donations there until the end of October or longer if needed. In Carolina Forest, Tana Huffstickler, News 13.